Hello! Today, you'll learn what is sales campaigns in Fresh Sales and how to create different types of campaigns. Sales campaigns lets you create, automate, and track effective outbound campaigns right from the CRM. With Fresh Sales, you can create two types of campaigns classic and smart. Classic campaigns is similar to traditional drip campaign. Set a series of steps in the campaign and run them on specific days. Smart campaigns, on the other hand, lets you tailor the campaign based on audience behavior. It executes the most relevant step in the campaign for each audience based on his or her response or level of interest. Thus, the right audience will receive the right message at the right time. To create a new campaign, click New Sales Campaign. You can also create a new campaign by clicking New and selecting Campaigns. Let's get started by creating a classic campaign. Click Edit and give a name for the campaign. A simple descriptive name helps in identifying the campaign anytime. I'll be creating a classic win-back campaign in this video. A win-back campaign intends to regain customers who bought your product or service and left. There are four steps involved in creating a sales campaign. First, select the audience for the campaign. Choose leads or contacts from fresh sales. You can also use data import to add a new set of leads or contacts for the campaign. Here, I'm selecting contacts. The next step is to define when the contacts have to enter the campaign. You can set multiple conditions based on contact property. For this campaign, I'm choosing Richard's contacts, who are now lost customers. The second step is to define the type of campaign. I've selected Classic Campaign. You can also switch between the type of campaigns here. Select the time and time zone that best suits your audience. I want to run this campaign at 11 a.m. Eastern Time. I don't want this campaign to run on weekends, so I'm leaving it selected. Thirdly, define the steps in the campaign. There are three types of actions that can be executed in a campaign. Email, follow-up task, and call reminder. Let's get started with setting up an email. The first email for the WinBack campaign will be sent on day one. The second action in the campaign is to send a follow-up email on day five. Select the day when you want the email to be sent. Set conditions to further refine the target audience. You can set multiple conditions based on email activity or the lead or contact property. Here, I have sent a first email and I want to send a follow-up email only if the contact has not opened the first email. Pick an existing email template to suit your campaign. With advanced settings, the email can be customized further. Start a new thread or send a reply to the previous mail in the campaign. Select the from and reply to email addresses. You can send the mail from the record owner's email ID or your ID. You can choose the reply to ID and also add CC or BCC if you would like to notify other people. You can add email signature, track the open and click rates of this email, and provide an option to unsubscribe. That's it with setting an email. The last step is to set a call reminder on day 7. Select the day and also the time at which you want to make the call. Note, reminders will be created based on your local time zone. Also, set multiple conditions to define when this action in the campaign has to be executed. Similarly, you can create a follow-up task. The final step is to define when you would want the audience to exit the campaign. In general, leads or contacts will exit the campaign when they complete all the steps or anytime they choose unsubscribe or if the email bounces. You can also set specific conditions based on the lead or contact property and define the exit point. All four steps in the campaign have now been defined. Click Save and Start to start running the campaign. If you don't wish to run the campaign right away, click Save and enable it later. That's it! The classic WinBack campaign will now run automatically on schedule. The first email will go on day 1, a follow-up email on day 5, and a call reminder would be set on day 7. Let's move to Smart Campaigns. I've created a smart prospecting campaign to qualify leads. As an example, smart campaigns get executed based on audience behavior in specific intervals. Select the interval in which the campaign should run along with the preferred time and time zone. 
Also, in smart campaigns, the most relevant step for each lead or contact will get executed in every iteration. In this example, the campaign will run every two days. When the campaign starts, the first email is sent to all the leads. After two days, when the campaign runs for the second time, the most relevant step for each lead will get executed. So, if a lead has replied to the email, a call reminder would be set. For leads who have not replied, a follow up email would be sent. You can also set exit conditions similar to classic campaigns and click Save. That's how smart campaigns work. View the list of campaigns by clicking your profile picture and selecting Sales Campaigns. Know how your sales campaigns are performing with campaign level and step level metrics. Go ahead, create a sales campaign and watch them run like clockwork. Happy selling!